and welcome to how to hem. I'm going to show you the how to hem toolkit and everything that you get in there and why it's going to make your hen party, otherwise known as a bachelorette party, planning journey much easier. So the how to hen toolkit is a whole bunch of documents that you can either print or you can just do online. I'm going to talk you through what all these documents are roughly so that you have a really great idea of why they're going to be so helpful for you. So the first one is your welcome and your introduction. That tells you everything that is in the pack, the rough order in which you should work through them. And just a sort of basic overview, it also has a clickable link. When you have these open digitally, they will all have clickable links. So open this one first so that you get a better idea of everything that's included. You then have your bridal consultation sheet. This one is in there because I always say the first thing that you should do in your planning journey is ask the bride. That is who your weekend is all about. So in there is a whole bunch of questions that you can ask her so that you know what you're doing when you go into your plan. You know what she's going to like. You know what she's really not going to like and really doesn't want. Hard nose. You're so much more prepared when you fill this out first. Then you have your thinking out loud questionnaire. This is a questionnaire for you to really get the brainstorming going, get the ideas running and focus on a place of bride coming first and not just what's available. It's such a common mistake that so many people make is to go and just find out what's available in the nearby area and then let's just do that. But I'm a big advocate for starting with your bride and thinking about her first and building a plan out that way. So this is the questionnaire that is going to get you thinking about all the right questions to start your planning with. Next thing we have is an accommodation comparison spreadsheet. Now this one and the next one are available in both a Word document and a spreadsheet format. The goal of this spreadsheet is to take all of the accommodation options that you're looking at and compare them really easily. And then you put that to one side and you move on to your activity comparison sheet. Again, this is a Word document and a spreadsheet so that you can easily have a think about all the stuff that you want to do over the weekend, any idea that comes to you when you're doing your research. Pop it into the sheet, think about what day you might want to do on because this already helps you think about your itinerary and it tracks all of your costs again. Then you have your weekend itinerary planner. This also comes available with a week itinerary because I know that some people go away for a whole week instead of a weekend. Essentially what you're gonna do is take your favorite activities from your activity comparison sheet and you're gonna start to slot them in to your planner or your itinerary and build out a rough idea of what the weekend's gonna look like. Then you have lists, 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 which is a huge document with every list you could ever need. All your shopping lists, not just for food and general activities, but for all of your DIY that you plan to do. There are also planning lists in here so you know how long any DIY is going to take you. And there's a room by room list so that you know exactly what needs to go in each room of your venue and you can check it off before you leave. And the last Mac Daddy best thing in the toolkit that is entirely worth getting the toolkit just for this is the master spreadsheet. So the master spreadsheet takes all of the best bits, you insert the best choices, your last few choices of your accommodation, your activity choices, your shopping lists, and you put all of that into the master spreadsheet and it will tell you what everything is going to cost, break it down into how much it's going to cost per person, and you have a tracker on the first page where you can insert who has paid what and how much money is left to pay, how much under or over budget you are going to be and how much you currently are. So it is the Mac Daddy for just keeping all of your stuff in one place that is easy to find, easy to organize and easy to track. And that means that you don't need to manually write anything down about who has paid what and who owes when and all of that other really annoying, frustrating stuff. This whole toolkit is designed to make your life easier. If these documents on their own were not enough, buying the toolkit gives you the key to unlock the rest of How to Hen, the fully fledged website. And let me tell you, it's infinitely bigger and more detailed than you can currently see if you do not have a login. So if you unlock the website, you will then have over a thousand ideas broken down into types of braid 
and theme. You can favorite them on the website and then you can add your favorites into your activity comparison sheet and then you can add that into your itinerary. It is all step by step. It means that there's one place for you to get inspired and there is everything in there from going out activities to staying in games to food to serve, ways to decorate, music to play, the whole nine yards, it is all in there ready for you so that you do not have to spend your life on Pinterest and Google and Instagram and feel like you are drowning in the sea of options. Keep it easy, keep it simple, save yourself the stress, okay? If you have any questions about the toolkit, you wanna to ask me anything at all, or if you just want some advice, please contact me. I offer free 30 minute calls to anyone who wants to talk about anything because giving your bride the best bachelorette weekend is my passion and making sure that you do not lose your mind in the process is what I want to do. So please reach out to me and uh, happy hemming, guys.